Hello and welcome. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how you can use the add days function in Power Automate. So the add days function in Power Automate is structured like this. You need to supply the date, then the number of days to add or remove, and then you can change the date format, but that's optional. So I'll show you how it works. So let's go to create. We go to build your own flow. Select manual trigger, click next and then skip to building your own flow. All right, so I'm gonna manually trigger this flow. I'm gonna go to new step. I'm gonna type in compose. Select Inside for inputs, let's go to the expression tab. And in the expression tab, I'm gonna say add days. UTC now, which will give us the current date that we're on. And in this example, I'm adding 10 days to the current date. Press OK. Now, if we were to test this to see what it looks like, let's save the flow. Test. Our output is February 4th, 2023. That's 10 days from today. Now, let's create an email. So I'm gonna go to send an email. Send it to myself. Let's say that this subject is going to be for payroll. I'm going to say payroll reminder. And in the body, I'm going to type in Good morning. Just a friendly reminder to please submit your information. And I want to put a date after the four. So I want to put that date that we have here. So in dynamic content, I can simply select outputs. It's going to put in that date that we just saw. So let's see what that looks like. So let me check my email. And you'll see that that date appears right there in the email.